Let's double check to make sure that everything's working. As per usual, it's going to take me a minute just to make sure that everything is working as intended. And it sounds like it is. All right, that's a good sign. <clears throat> Gotta do this real quick, sorry. All right, and we're all set. Hey, how's it going, Pyrax? How you doing today? It's ready up. The real P100 uh, unknown was inside us all along. How's it going, Jamster? How's it going? How's it going? I'm doing all right. Uh, I had a little bit of a rough uh, day at the end of work. Uh, because today people just decided to come in like right at the end, right as I was about to, um, we're just going to ready up here straight up right as I was about to start closing up and they decided to just, instead of buying shit, they decided to speak with one another. <laughs> so I was there till like 20 minutes past closing, which really sucked. Hey, how's it going, Dord? How you doing today? And we're going to get in some unknown games in today. Oh, shoot. I also have to do the um the challenges. That's another thing. I have not done the challenges. I entirely forgot about them. So I need to finish them. Currently at P93. Who are you prestiging again, Jamster? I don't... I, I <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Like, the past few days that I streamed, I, I was not even, like, mentally there. I, I was not comprehending anything that was going on. I have forgotten a lot of stuff. <laughs> Ash, that's right. I was going to say, like, Ash was the one that was, like, tip of my head. All right. We are on Dead Dog. Very good map to start off on. Very much like Dead Dog. There's challenges. Yep. There's always, um like, tome challenges with this sort of thing. I want to know. I want to see if I can hit her. I don't think that I have that ability. Yeah, no. She's, like, crouching right at, like, this shit here. Can I come around here? Cool. Come say hello to Elodie. I haven't played DVD in a few days. I'm going to leave, guys. You get a big smack there on Michaela. Nice. <laughs> Dude, how are you going to let me down you? You're up top. <laughs> Bro, come on. There's no shot. You're just letting me do this. There's no shot. Probably one of the eight Ash mains in the world. True. Not a lot of people play Ash, but Ash is a fire character. Oh my god. We can snipe him. Oh my god. Right there. He's, he's going to get hit. No. He probably bounced. Oh my god, I'm so good at the video game, boys. Oh my god. Alright, let's get this girl down. Dude! I'm destroying! Jesus! Oh, he picked himself up. That's 100% unbreakable. Good shit. He still goes down, though. Nothing you can get to. Bro, I'm destroying them right now. Thanks for a background stream because the games are stressful. Yeah, dude, the games are stressful. I'm just trying to try to meme around for a minute. Oh, that's so good. I can sneak up top here. Maybe I don't sneak up top and instead I just come around like this. Nice, good shit. I need to run away. Come around like this. 
She's going to run over here to go get that unhook, probably, right? Oh, this Michaela doesn't look behind her. It's a fatty M1. Damn, that would have been so good, too. That was good of her. Well played on her end. Good shit. I'm gonna pretend to pick up here in a second. Damn, I missed her. Shame. Pick up. Nice. All right, let's get her on the hook. Hey, how's it going, Greedy? How you doing today? And Uga, how's it going? How you guys doing today? The un the known is knowing, true, dude. Come around here. Fatty snipes, baby! Dude, honestly, I'm not going to lie. Playing unknown without, like, stressing about blood points. Very fun. Without stressing about, like, winning or playing well. He just works, you know? Bro just works. I'm gonna hit her. She can go get the unhook if she wants. Or she can do that. Well played. I missed her. Alright. Guessing that I can hit that? Right about... There? Nah, I can't hit it. Shame. GG's. God, these guys have five gen or these guys still have five gens up, and I'm about to kill this Nia. This poor Nia, dude. Great Conan Exiles gameplay, dude. This is like have you have you What the hell? Well played. Let's say, have you ever seen Conan Exiles? Oh, Shit, that would have been so good. Oh, if that bounced and hit him. I've got big plans for anniversary. That's all you need to know. <laughs> big, big plans. Howdy, gamer. Ooh, well played. We'll break this door. I'll pour it out this way. Damn, I missed her. That's sad. Oh, well, we'll leave her. Look, Michaela's making herself known. Hell if I know why. On a scale of you Yui to Jane. Uh they're they're like they're like Bubba sized. How's that sound? They're Bubba sized plans. Mm, well played. Doink. Uh, I could slug for the 4K, but Elodie's going to get revealed here. 
I have Bubba-sized plans for anniversary. We already know that she's kind of around this area. If she doesn't reveal herself, she either has distortion or she's hopped into a locker. Now, she may have hopped into a locker. We know for a fact that she was running this way. So if there's lockers on the back here, then we know that she's in this area. Possibly back this way. She might have even gone into here. For shadow step value. Oh my god, that's shadow step. Okay, never mind. I'm screwed. We ain't finding her. Never mind. We about to find her. Alright, I thought I could bounce that on the rock from there, but I want the LED. LED. Oh, LED. That was not the play. That's quite big, yeah. We got big, big plans for for Annie. Boinga. Michaela screams. She had no clue where the fuck I was. GG's. That was a fat first game right there for sure. I usually do poorly on this map with uh, Unknown. Kind of glad we were able to do well, you know. Drop this down just for the extra BPs. <sighs> Three sixty seven. We finished our challenge too. I should go over that as well. Wait a minute, what? Oh no, Rift closes in ten days. This event thing closes. Very soon after. But yeah, G. Geez. Oh my god, we're gonna have to spend points too. <laughs> I haven't played in a little bit, so. Alright. This this event ends in 17 hours. I need to finish all of this. You can watch until you have work. Hey, how's it going, Esther? How you doing today? Gain two droplets by any means. That's not even that hard. It's ready up. Got our P100 unknown. We're chilling. Guys, also, look at this. Look at that. Just the bottom row there. So beautiful. When does the event end? Tomorrow morning. 10 a.m. EST tomorrow. Twins rework after three years. Going to be crazy. I'm actually very much looking forward to the Twins rework. I actually am very, very excited for it. I have um, a few videos planned, so I'm going to do an unknown video. It's going to be a slightly different format than most of my P100 videos. Um, and then after I do the uh, video for him, what I plan on doing is I'm going to do a um, video about Blight's change um, on the PTB because I think that's easily the biggest L of the whole thing. I think everything else except for... I think every change except for two of the changes on it are good changes, in my personal opinion. I think that they are good changes. Um, minus Blight's hug tech removal and the ultimate wef weapon change. I think those two are big misses, in my, in my personal opinion. From my understanding, Victor is now a Legion member and Charlotte can run. Yes, yes, she can. Pose an interesting killer concept in Discord. I don't think uh, you'll like it, but I'm curious on what your thoughts are. I'll look at it later. Yeah, yeah I'll take a look at it later. Um, but yeah, I have a, I have a video planned um, for Blight's Hug Tech removal. It's going to be similar to like the Skull Merchant video I posted on, from her PTB. They removed Hug, hug Tech. Yeah, they're going to be removing Hug Tech in the uh, PTB. That's what Blight's change said. It said that they've improved collision so he doesn't slide off of objects anymore. And people asked if that was like removing hug techs and a dev confirmed that yes, you are no longer able to hug tech. The thing is, is like 
I don't think it's the worst thing in the world, so long as they didn't screw up his dashes entirely. If they fucked up his collision, then it's a very bad change and it needs to be reverted. But if his collision is still okay, then he's fine, you know? Okay, well played. He doesn't make anything. Not even that window. M1. Got a live brainer. Get a hit. What the fuck was that? Well played. I'm actually going to come up here. And he goes. Kind of excited about the twins. At first, I was skeptical. Um, but after thinking about it, it would be cool. I think that the twins is actually going to be very fun. It means that you basically can just play Victor now. Like, no questions asked. <laughs> I'm kind of a dick for that, but it was funny. The window in me is probably the worst window in my experience. It's a good window if you have lithe. That's literally it. If you don't have lithe, that window is completely worthless. I'm 5% faster, so I don't have to worry about that pallet. I think I want to come over here and instead of M1-ing him, if he goes to grab from the front, which he does, I can M1. Uh, she's going to come up this way. She doesn't look behind her, so that's going to hit. Oh, wow, it doesn't. Okay, never mind. Don't listen to me. Now, mentally prepared for the DS buff to come live. It's just reverting DS back to what it used to be. I'm actually very okay with it. DS has been in a very bad state for quite some time. Bro used live. Oh, my God. Shit. We take those. Damn. Unlucky. You got nurse teched? Unlucky. <laughs> Should have just played better. <laughs> Shouldn't have gotten tunneled. <laughs> Alright, well, I am. Ooh. No, I wanted to be fatty snipes. Okay, I'm still fatty snipes, but you know. Get the M1 on him, and then we'll go for the M2. Easy connect right there. Oh my god, that was a sick bounce. You couldn't even tell me that that wasn't a sick bounce, guys. That was fire, and you know it. I feel like the lobby is a little bit laggy. Oh my god, I'm so fucking crazy. Shame. She's OTR. I am going to connect this, by the way. Never mind. We're going to come over here. We're going to connect to that one. Okay, that was a little bit of an odd bounce. Okay. We need an astronaut Billy skin for nostalgia, bro. We need Space Billy back for nostalgia. Can I fucking hit that? Oh my god, I can hit that. That's range. It's not range? How is that not range? Oh. Yeah, this lobby is laggy. Oh, well, there goes someone. Well played. I'm going to go up here. He's not going to know where we went. 
He's gonna continue running forward. Oh, that almost fucking hit him. God, I played that so well. Okay, that's fine. That's an M1. Oh, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi. Bro doesn't get it. He goes down. Like, why remove Space Billy when it's considered funny and a meme throughout the whole community? Because it breaks the game is the problem with Space Billy. I understand their removal for Space Billy because it did break the game. <laughs> Same thing with, like, Space Victor. People stopped, uh, you know, or not stopped, but they uh, didn't allow Space Victor for the same reason. Oh. I want to kick this gen. He gave up on Hook. Oh, she found the hatch, shame. I had her, dude. In the palm of my hand. I have to get one more uh, blood orb. But yeah, those guys played well. Nostromo is honestly... I really don't like Nostromo. But for this killer specifically, Nostromo is probably one of my most like favorite maps. Like, I love Nostromo on this killer. Specifically unknown. <laughs> Superior Billy is the best Billy skin. True, true. Sees three bound envelopes and gets excited. Also me forgot I'm not playing Survivor. Unlucky. Someone like unknown now? Look. He's grown on me. <laughs> Honestly, I'm going to bully the shit out of, of uh, Killers with the new um, DS buff. With it going back to its original state. I thought that the original, like, drop down to three seconds was the biggest mistake that they ever did with uh, DS. Well, Jimmy, I'm not even going to lie. Like, I play a lot of Killer. I'm a Killer main. And I think DS being a five-second stun was okay. Sure, it's annoying, but it does counter tunneling. Once they made it like an anti-tunnel perk, then it was perfectly fine. The moment they, you know, did that, I was cool with DS. Fully okay with it. They drop it down to three seconds, nerfing it. I'm like, dude, DS is terrible. There is no reason you should ever, and I mean ever, not take a DS. If you have the option to. Three seconds is nothing. And now it's back up to five seconds, so it's a lot of, like, you gotta play around it now, you know? Hey, how's it going, Sabrini? How you doing today? Badham is an underrated unknown map? No, dude. Badham sucks. Badham's really bad. I, I actually really like Borgo on him, though. <laughs> Borgo's also fun. Badham's too open, in my opinion. And there's a lot of, like, enclosed places, like houses, where you can't really do a whole lot with. You can shoot through floors, but that's not super amazing um, when they have so much space upstairs. All right, Thompson House. I think corn maps are really good for him, too. It's, like, his reveal mechanic through corn is very finicky. I need to grab this one first so that we can finish our challenge, like, straight up. Dinga. Alright, so that's Shaq. They're doing like a totem. They're booning. Booner. Alright. Come around here. This is range. Perfect. That's always a like Steve, bro. Nice. Dude, 
dude. I'm fucking crazy. Anniversary will only be slightly worse BP um, than the Blood Moon. People will actually bring cakes. I think that um, Blood Moon is very inconsistent with the cakes, uh, with the BP offerings, and it's blood points in general. Yes, it's better, but it's not like amazing, amazingly. You know, it's like, yeah, it's a 400% multiplier. That's what we have. Nice. Good shit. Let's pretend like we're actually uh, going through the side there, but we're really coming out this way. I'm gonna try to, like, orbital her. Oh my god, dude! Yo! <laughs> she wasn't expecting that! <laughs> The anniversary powers were a lot of fun to use. Remote break was incredibly busted. Yeah, well played. He dodges that. Just by walking. Goodbye. Anniversary is going to be a lot more, um... You know... A lot more consistent. Please hit. Oh my god, I'm so good. I played. She's gonna get her thing off now because of that. Is that miss? Oh, you're chasing me? You're not chasing me. Go away. I'll eat your DS. It's three seconds. Snoibed. And now you're my obsession. So that has a tunnel. T -t -t tunnel. Also window. Perfectly fine by me. Nurse with both me add-ons feels weird. Yeah, it'll take a little bit of getting used to, but once you get used to it and, like, once you get used to it and you can actually hit a lot of blinks, you can be so oppressive once you take him off. Oh, he went up the ramp there. Was not expecting that. Howdy, buddy. Bro's got a key. Well played. 6% hindered. Oh, he went for the pallet, bro. Well played. Yeah. Dude, this Steve's good. And he fucking left Shaq, too. What a Chad. I should leave him, but he's my obsession, and I kind of want value. Oh, you don't got shit to move here. Oh, you have nothing. You're 6% hindered. You're dead. Nice dead hard. Predictable. I learned the max distance, and now um, I have that. I can't blink as far. Yeah, 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 you won't be able to blink nearly as far. Shit. Just a double check there.
Alright. I could tunnel. I would prefer not to. It's going to be an M2. And follow that up with a crazy one here. Yep. Let's get this hook. They're definitely on that far gen. I missed it. Dude, this Jonah, man. You get an 8 at a P100, currently 25, and I want your opinion. Should I go for Steve or Jill next? Honestly, it's whoever you want. Like, I myself just go for P100s that I enjoy playing. Ooh, she's not going to see me? She's not going to see me? Hello. M1. Just going to use that. Hit her with that. Very nice. Ada's dead, too, so we should really catch her. Dude, I'm I'm fucking cracked. That was a bounce off of the tractor that she didn't even know where it was gonna land. She panicked and ran back into it. Hey, right, you gotta go to work now. Have a good one, Esther. Thanks for stopping in. Hope you have a wonderful day at work. Ah, they finished the heal. Right about there should hit. Nah, I missed it just barely. Shame. You know they're going to run into Shaq. But yeah, if you like uh, Steve or Jill better, just go for them. That was a good dead hard. See that? Unknown is knowing. True. We're going to shoot a little bit over. And we hit him, dude. Bounce off the wall, man. Jesus. You just gotta shoot and spin, bro. You just gotta shoot and spin. I fucked that up. It's fine. I'm almost certain they're on the, uh... Other gen, though. I can shoot up there. Just for the hell of it. I missed it, dude. I'm so bad. Maybe way closer. Yeah, there we go. So that was way too short for the amount of issues they had. Yeah, it really, really was, wasn't it? <coughs> Honestly, Unknown can kind of fucking hold a 3 gen, can he? Yeah, their shit that they gave us was that they uh, gave a BP incentive, or a BP uh, compensation of one mil. Oh, they were healing in basement. I see one. I'll kill you both. There's no reason not to do one or the other, you know? <laughs> On the floor. <laughs> GG's. The offering uh, didn't even work. Yep. The offering didn't work. The BP uh, original incentive was not good. And, um, yeah. Nah, I'm sorry. I can't do it.
We're just going to put you on the hook here. Baby Jonah. Baby Jonah indeed. Yeah, that wouldn't hit the person on that side. It's fine though. You know, like, kind of like slug this just like right in there. Hit the lights. Nah, miss the lights. Shame. Those guys are playing well though. Three thirty-five, dude. We have so many blood points. It's like for the, every three games you get a goddamn prestige level. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't played since I got the P one hundred. So like, just coming back to it and just like chilling, not really caring about the event. Like, it's so nice. It's so nice to just sit back, relax, just kind of chill. Like, not play for you know. For wins, for points, for anything. Just just do, bro. Just fucking play. I do need to spend these points at some point, though. <laughs> Dracula from Castlevania. Uh, gonna go hard if the leak is correct. I agree, dude. I've always wanted a vampire killer. And if we're getting Dracula from Castlevania, that's gonna be super pog. In all honesty, this event should have been released when Dracula came out. What if the leaks are true, Dracula comes back, and this is like a biannual uh, event? Wouldn't that be cool? Imagine his prestige skin. Bro, it better be bloody as hell. It better be the bloodiest prestige skin. I don't know why. But the more that I, like, look at Unknown, the more, like, I just think that his prestige skin is the best skin that he has. Like, he has potential for very good skins, but, like, right now, his prestige skin is just the best. If you look at his head, it looks like he's crying blood. Like, you'll see it here. Look at that. It looks like he's crying blood. It's so cool. I made a Wesker give up mid-chase because he didn't uh, give up on me, and then the gens popped. Yeah. I have made many Weskers DC against me. I kind of want to play some Survivor at some point, too, uh, during stream, because in all honesty, I really want to play against some unknowns. So I think unknown is a very bad killer because of how easy his counterplay is. And I mean, I haven't gone up against, like, super good unknown players. I've just gone up against, like, people trying him out. And I've completely broken their ankles. If I go up against an unknown who has, like, my skill level or better. I don't know how I'm going to feel about it. In all honesty, I would like to see that because I want to know if my survivor brain, even though I am not a good survivor in comparison to my killer, I want to know if I'm right. You know, a behavior, original vampire was shown in the tome. Ooh, his skins are mid. Yeah. Even worse. It was on, uh, Oh, excuse me. It was on a uh, a bad Wesker map. Ooh, Hawkins. Yeah, no, that is rough. I've gone to Hawkins on a lot of killers. A lot of the killers that I play are really bad on Hawkins, so I don't like it. Um, and if I don't get, like, an injure on someone within, like, the first two or three usage of my power, I just leave. I'm just like, nope, fuck it. We're done. I'll find someone else. You're currently not working on any gens, so, like, I know you're not being productive, at least for another, like, 20 seconds, so I'm gonna go find someone else. Toba! Toba's an odd map. I don't think that I played much unknown on this map. It's an original Vlad the Impaler, um, but Vampire? Gotcha, gotcha. I have to create two blood zones, so blood zone number one. Where is blood zone number two? What? Come here, Nicholas. Oh, he's my obsession, too. Yeah, there's no way you're dodging that, bro. Oh, that didn't hit him? That's sad, dude. Nice, we got a hit on that. Very, very strong. I 
And that's my obsession down. When does a video release? Not a clue. I haven't even started working on it yet. I want to get it out quickly because I want to make a video on the PTB as well with uh, twins. Mainly, I want to make the thing about Blight. Like, Blight getting hug, te hug tech removed is really sad. That doesn't actually bounce twice. Sad. Damn, dude. Shame. I might just bloodless this pallet out of him. Mm, don't have to. I can leave. Hello, Nick Cage. Ooh, honestly, bouncing it like that is kind of crazy. Oh, he dead-hearted that. That was good. Hit Yui. Come over here. Say hello to Nick again. Steve got his shit off. Well played. That's a very good sprint burst there. I can just tunnel this guy. Or I can just go after Steve. Steve's got fucking all here. I want to learn Blight, but I hate the fact that uh, slide off of almost everything might enjoy the new collision. I think that the fact that he slides off of everything makes him a lot worse. Oh, Claudette, you're so fucked. Oh, Claudette. Very nice. Who's next on the list for P100? Right now, if it's um, if I can get a P100 before anniversary, it's gonna be Billy because Billy's already P40. Uh, but if not before anniversary, uh, anniversary is gonna be a secret. That's OTR. I'll hit you. Show the hell of it. Thank you. I will take this pallet for free, and I will leave. What? I pick you up. Is your goal to have every killer P100? No, no. I just get uh, killers of P100 that I enjoy playing. Oh, that bounce actually kind of screwed me. He would have been uh, hit by that. It is what it is, though. It's too much shit on Toba. Nice. Bro, I thought you had fucking sprint burst. You have live? Oh my god, dude. And he goes. Let's give this hook here. Seeing as you're a nursemaid, I thought I'd ask. Um, you're learning nurse. Should I use gen? No, don't use gen slowdown or regression. I personally think if you use gen slowdown or regression, you're actually hurting your ability to learn the killer. Hold on. Damn, that would have been cool. 
uh, because it forces like gender regression is a safe choice. Like if you're losing a lot of games, sure you can use it and it'll help you out. But like if you want to learn a killer and you want to be very lethal with them, you're gonna have to learn how to put yourself into bad situations and overcome those situations. You know. This is OTR. I got adrenaline too. Shame. I can still kill him though. He's not in a good spot. Well, unless he ran this way, and then I have no way of tracking him. So good shit. Fast heal. Nice. Yeah, good shit. I have one gen to slow down on killers, and um, I know, and I know I'm good at. I gotcha. Sometimes you need it, but in all honesty, I think that like there's no real reason you should use it. Um, if you play with no gen slowdown, you're gonna get way better results. Uh, just like from pushing yourself um, to go for very inopportune uh, chases and being able to like get them, you know, or like kill them. Like right now, I have no gen slowdown, as you can see. Ooh, Nick Cage. I'm gonna pre-drop that pallet. I kinda just need to zone him away from the gate. Look where he's going. I don't have anything over there to hit him with. He turned around. That turning around is not going to help him, though. Okay, it did help him, because he just ran this way. Ran further into the abyss. Oh my god, I'm so good! Oh my god, dude! He wasn't expecting that. Holy shit. Get the axe in the shop that makes the axe blue, it's awesome. I actually just really like my prestige one. GG's. See in the blood zone. You really play gen slowdown, and when I do, I'm just bored and just want to mix it up. If I put on gen slowdown, I'm really just trying to have like the chillest or the most try hard map match ever. There is no in between. <laughs> Like, I'm trying to have the chillest or the most try-hard map, or match in the world. Alright. At least look at the blue axe. Uh... <laughs> Better than your family? Okay. <laughs> I'll take a look at it. Let's turn in this challenge and select a new one first. What do we got for this? 775k? Steal two droplets from a survivor. Let's just do this one. Just to, you know, get her done. Uh, and let me grab... What the hell? Where is it? I wanted to get um. this. I wanted that Oni sword because it looks cool. I, will, I don't have enough for the Oni outfit, though. Shame. Do I even care about this LED outfit? Am I going to really use it? I might use those pants. I don't know if I'm going to use that shirt, though. Do I even play LED? Not really. Do I need to get it? Probably not. Let's go to the store. Let's check it out. Oh, that's not the right thing. Unknown uh, weapons. The blue axe... There's a few different blue axes. I like this one. This one's pretty, good, pretty nice. This one's okay. That one's just an axe. He has a yellow axe. Ooh. That one kind of looks okay. Ooh, this one's Damascus. That's cool. I like that one a lot. Eh, that one's whatever. And then he has his wrench. I have the... um. 
the cutters because I thought they were going to have like physics. They don't. All right, I'm going to actually spend some points, guys. I'm going to I'm going to take a minute. We're going to put some points into Billy real quick. We're going to get a new emblem, guys. Are you excited to be earning 20 to 30k a match? No. <laughs> also, how are you doing, Red? I don't think I said hello. Wait, time, do you hold any DVD world records? No, unfortunately, I do not. I guess I could technically hold one if you count DCs. I could technically have the world's fastest uh, nurse match. My game was um, 10 seconds long. I ended up two tapping someone right at the start of the game and then the entire game DC'd. <laughs> get Damascus axe? Nah, I'm good. I'm good. We're gonna get to 41 Billy here and then we'll go back to unknown. Oh my god, I'm just auto buying, bro. They should add a Pyrax. Ha! That's a knee slapper. good how the game's been today they've been really chill like i'm not i'm not playing for blood points right now i'm just playing to chill and i'm just doing weird shit like i love just doing weird shit in the video game that is like my favorite pastime if i just if i play the game for good plays this game is so much fun <laughs> Go for quickest DC nurse games. I've actually gotten very close to world record nurse games. Like, genuine world record nurse games. My uh, shortest one was like 2 minutes 10 seconds. I think the record for the shortest nurse game is like a minute 50. You should do P100 Singularity, man. Singularity, um... He's, like, he's a killer I enjoy playing every once in a while, but right now he is not currently on my list. So it might be a little while until I get to him. But I enjoy them, though. Do P100 Unknown is crazy. Uh, I today just got my first P100, Kate. Nice! Congratulations! Yeah, I was uh, I was very close to world first P100 Singularity. Or not Singularity. P100 um, Unknown. I was world second. Which I, I guess I can't complain about. I wasn't actually going for world first. But the fact that I was seven hours off kind of makes me like a little irritated. Like, I gotta redeem myself now, you know? <laughs> Speed the chainsaw on Billy. No, I'm not good at Billy, dude. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I am not good at Billy at all. P100 twins? Honestly, maybe. P100 twins might be fun because um, twins is on my list currently. If they rework, does like twins justice? I might have to do it. You know, might have to do it. Who is also, uh, can we see your killers? I want to see who you have P100 out of curiosity. Yeah, sure. Uh, as soon as I finish this blood web, we can look it over. Or not blood web, but this prestige for Billy, we can look over my P100s. Uh, and the first, the world first P100 is Voss on Twitter. He got a P100 March 27th, 1030 AM. I actually technically got it eight hours after him, but I got it at 530 PM. That same day. No, I'm not P100ing Spirit. I hate Spirit. I really, really do. Spirit is one of my least favorite killers. Victor is a dodgeball now. <laughs> I really like that analogy. That's funny. If you can dodge a ball, you can dodge a baby. <laughs> oh my god how's it going jason 24 how you doing today yeah and again as soon as we finish out this prestige here we'll uh we'll go over and check out our prestige 100s we'll have to go to survivor first because i do have p100 ace he's the only p100 survivor i will ever get unless they come out with vigo and that is like like, I, I guarantee you that's exactly what I'm going to do. If, if he comes out, if Vigo ever comes out, he is my only other P100 survivor. P100, Dwight, absolutely not. <laughs> it's not going to happen. P100, Freddy, he's on the list. He's on the list. He was my first ever killer main. Hey, how's it going, Magic Bot? How you doing today? 
Pure Hunter Myers, maybe? Eh, Myers is not quite on that list, unfortunately. Like, I didn't find him fun every once in a while, but a lot of his, um, you know, gameplay comes from his add-ons. And I don't really like that. I don't use a lot of add-ons. Or I don't use any add-ons, I should say. The add-ons that I do use are usually for bu uh, build requests. Um... And, like, meme add-ons. Like, for example, I run Nurse with Dull Bracelet, White Knit Comb every once in a while. So that I can just be better at Nurse. If you ever feel like you're you're playing Nurse and you're playing really bad, like... First off, have, like, a good knowledge of Nurse. And if you feel like you have, like, bad games and you're not playing as best as you can... Just put Dull Bracelet, White Knit Comb on for an extended period of time. Maybe, like, a week. And then when you take them off, you're not going to miss any blinks. You literally won't. It's so, so good. You got a, uh, yeah, you got uh, him on your birthday. Saw the video, man. Yep, I've been getting, I got uh, Ace on my birthday. Ace has been my survivor main since he came out. Legitimately, I love Ace. In one of my very earliest videos on a different channel that I will not disclose, uh, he uh, came out and I just said, Ace is like an upgraded version of Dwight. And guess what? I'm still correct. I will die on that hill. <laughs> Ace is an upgraded version of Dwight. P100 Steve from Minecraft? Bro, if, if Steve from Minecraft comes into... <laughs> into Dead by Daylight, that's gonna be a fucking... That's gonna be a collab. <laughs> oh my god. Imagine, dude. P100 Artist? Mmm. Artist is like a killer that I enjoy. I just don't play a lot of Artist. Like, Artist is oddly not like someone who I think about too much. Right, there's P41. Alright, let's take a look here. How come no auto buy? Uh, we're not doing auto buy because if you do auto buy, um, you spend more of your points. Um, and I don't like spending points. Also, if you can see here, I don't have like any survivors prestiged up. To be fair, from. Hattie all the way back, I have all of the perks unlocked because of, uh, it used to be you have to get to level 40 instead of, like, prestige your character. So all of these survivors who are not prestiged at all, um, are, I, I have their perks. Care Bear, I'm sorry, I'm not playing survivor, I'm playing killer. But yeah, we're gonna be, I'm just showing off Ace P100 here. Because someone asked to show off the P100s. All right, we got a uh, Nurse P100. We've got a uh, Blight P100. We got Wesker P100, and then take like, a look at this <laughs> Zeno Chucky Unknown. <laughs> Teach me, uh, or yeah, the teachable uh, perks and blowwebs. Yep, the same uh, with my survivors. Indeed, one million active players. If Steve from Minecraft releases, true, true. What's blood point maxing? Blood point maxing is just. Um, Making sure you're spending your blood points efficiently. All right. Let me get into a game here. We've got uh, 75k blood points. That's not even hard, dude. That's not even hard. Hey, how's it going, Nova Corner? How you doing today? Did you get... Uh, did you go for P100 on Unknown just because new killers are the only chance at being world first P100 of that character? No, actually, I wasn't even trying to go for world first on this guy. I wasn't even trying to go for a world first on unknown. Um, I was just leveling him up because I thought it would be funny to level up a character I don't even like. Because when he first came out, I didn't like him. And I wanted to make a video on um, me getting a character to P100 that I hate. And it turns out I actually like this guy. But the video is still going to be uh, kind of like spiteful towards him. And then I'm going to kind of like, you know, narrow it down a little bit or like bring it down a little bit. I'm going to go from a 10 to a 2, like right at the start of the gates. We need a Xenomorph game? I can play a Xeno game. I'm actually a pretty damn good Xeno, in my opinion. Breaking that P100 streak would be a crime. Which, what P100 streak? Dude, P100 Chucky is insane. I wish it was me. P100 Chucky uh, was actually a lot of fun to do. I actually very much enjoy Chucky. I find him to be a little bit, um, like, spirit in the sense that, like, he is very easy to play uh, for how powerful he is. Um, but I still find him fun. Like, he's still a good killer. Any tips for recent blood point grinding, especially for working high school students like me? The best thing that you need to know if you're grinding blood points is to just play the game 
uh, at, a, at a rate that you find comfortable. Because if you burn yourself out, you're not going to be able to get to P100. Like, I know this for a fact. I burnt myself out on DBD so many times that I just stopped. Like, I literally, when Skull Merchant came out, I stopped playing the game. I stopped playing the game for a solid month and a half. I waited until mid-chapter. And then I came back. Um, but just make sure you're not burning yourself out so that you can continue playing and continue liking, you know, what you're doing, you know? Because if you're not liking what you're doing, you're not going to have fun. You're just going to resent the game. Oh my god, there's a third person here? Where'd this girl go? Ah. Oh, that didn't hit. It's so sad. I can hit her, though. If I... No, I can't. Shame. That's gonna hit. We're gonna come around here. Very nice. She's playing this very well. I'm gonna take this blood, and we're gonna, like... I'm gonna play in very odd ways, guys. I needed to hit that, unfortunately. She just gets it off now. Ooh, she gets hers off, too. Very well played. Well played. She's going to revolt. And now we're just going to get this uh, girl here. Does not make that window. Try as she might. Basement. Finish shack. That's fine by me. Oh, big hits, dude. <laughs> that was a play. If you want a character that you just hate, do Skull Merchant. I could do Skull Merchant, but Skull Merchant wasn't a recent killer. <laughs> I didn't like this killer um, because of like a lot of shit. He actually just made me mad. Like Skull Merchant, Skull Merchant, yes, is a killer that I hate, but she's just an M1 killer pretty much. Like she's nothing special to hate on, you know, because everyone hates her. This guy is a very unique case because he gave me so much hope and disappointed me and it's not his fault. It's an wow. That was some fucking stupid movement that actually caught me off guard. Yeah, this table's not bad. But, like, this guy gave me so much hope, and he disappointed me in so many ways. So, like, that's why I said I hate him. I'm gonna come around like this. Pretend like I didn't see her. And then I'm gonna actually fucking just one-tap her there. My raid is, uh... Open DBD. Um play for four to five hours take a two-hour break then go back on oh my god that's that's not healthy <laughs> yeah i definitely i only do that if it's an event like this event i did a shit ton of that where go survivor do you think this is just like full forms that shit Nice. This makes me want to play DBD, but at the same time, I want to keep watching. <laughs> Do what you want, man. 
You should be playing DVD right now, like straight up. There's no reason that you shouldn't be playing. The event's about to end, and this event is disgustingly good for blood points. Perfect. I don't want to tunnel the Nancy. So I'm going to have to go after the Ada. Oh, if that fucking hit. Double hit there. It's gonna come to Shack. I don't want to tumble the Nancy, but it is what it is, you know. These guys are playing really, really well. I'm going to do something really risky, really stupid. Oh my god! Holy shit! Oh, I'm so good! Oh my god! Holy fuck, dude. That's insane! I may not win this game, but that was sick. I don't need to fucking be here. I can leave. That needs to be in the vid. That's going in the vid, dude. That's crazy. She's downstairs here. Oh my god, dude. Adrenaline. Where are we plan to go there? No adrenaline, she doesn't have it. What am I talking about? Poor people buckle up is mega cringe. That was just stupid, dude. That's crazy. All right. The hell is she? Oh my god, dude! Hold up! Watch! 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 Get sniped! I fucking missed! <laughs> Shit! Uh... She want me to just take pop shots at her? I'll take pop shots at her. Oh, I'm not even aiming well enough, dude. That's my problem. Oh, well played. Yeah, well played. GG's. I can't catch her now. GG's. Alright, let's see. There's too much shit in the way. I'll let them finish their heal. I just want to get a 
Them too. Just a little bit longer. GG. <laughs> Victor has such a kickable forehead. Yes, he does. Very nice. How many did we get from that? 258. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, that was a good game. Like, even though I played kind of poorly there, I had, I had some crazy shots, guys. <laughs> like, that was insane. <clears throat> All right. So uh, I have this stupid thing that I came up with in my mind. What if I get every single killer to P99 level 50 and I got uh, everything to P100 in one day? Go for it. It's definitely going to be very difficult to do. It'll probably take you multiple years because, like, that's... If you're doing it the most efficient... Oh, excuse me. If you're doing it the most efficiently... Or in the most efficient way possible, it's still going to take you over a year and a half to do. Closer to two years, honestly. If you're doing it in the most efficient way possible. If you're leveling faster than I am. Um, so realistically, it's probably going to be like five years for someone to be able to do that. Of like solid grinding on everyone. Otz is trying to do something like that. And even he himself is only at like prestige 20 on every killer. I don't know why, but I want a P100 Legion, but I would hate myself for it as well. Legion's a good character to prestige 100 straight up. He gets a lot of blood points, and he's actually pretty easy and pretty fun to play. <clears throat> I really should just do killer ones. Why am I doing these? I have to hook eight survivors. That's because I want to go for the epilogue. Uh, let's buy the LED pants. Oh, wait, no, we need to buy the Oni outfit. Oni outfit first. LED pants later. <clears throat> time i think i made a build that people hate on legion because half the lobby dcs a lot of people just dc for any reason you give them any reason and it's like bro <laughs> i had two people dc in a friendly match that i was trying to play with this guy i was just trying to go for cross map snipes from the top of ormond and two people dc'd because i wasn't trying <laughs> You already main him? Nice. Go for it. Get him to P100. Uh, in my personal experience, like, getting anyone to P100 that is not your main first feels bad. So, like, I, I tried to do that with Wesker. Wesker was going to be my first ever P100. I got him to Prestige 14, and I was like, no, I can't. Like, it has to be Nurse. You know? You can do Blight as well, but he's just too good, uh, so I don't see the fun in that. Blight is fun, though. Blight's a lot of fun. They are removing his hug tech, though, so lots of a lot of fun mechanics are going to be just removed. Bras me on DVD. Legion uh, from Killer Pov. Legion from Survivor Pog. Yeah. People just don't like Legion. Ooh, a fifth year cake. If you say it's okay to play Legion, I have myself a... <laughs> A task? Go for it, dude. I play Nurse, so, like... <laughs> like, Nurse is my main killer. So, I I have, like, the worst of it. Not true. Skull Merchant mains have the worst of it. I just have one of the worst of it, you know? People hate Nurse. Just got a 4K because they were dumb. True. I get 4Ks because survivors throw super hard quite often. And with a build like this, I can kind of capitalize on it really easily. Is that fucking three distortions I see? Dog, that's three fucking distortions that I see. Hey, what's up, buddy? I missed that hard. I'll break this door. Oh my god, he's mad, dude. Well played. We're gonna come out this way. Say fuck it. Say hello to Bill. Yeah. <coughs> 
healthy M1 on him. And he goes... You get this hook. This will help us out quite a bit. Missed. Sprint burst. Kelly. No pallets. So that's an M1. No pallet here either. It's a big M1. Hopefully he doesn't look behind him because he has sprint burst. Yeah, he doesn't look behind him too, too well. Dwight's going to get his thing off. Well played by Steve there. He's going to not vault the window, but he's just going to run straight forward probably. Dude, that's cringe. Well played. And he goes... I don't have to move him away. I, I can't ho hook him on that one. Because he'll get my hallucination there. Night mains. Night mains also get quite a bit of hate. I'm going to break this one. I think that they're on this gen here. This is range. Hey, what's up? Nice. <clears throat> right, I gotta put her on this hook here. And we can teleport to that guy. Steve's already on this gen. We need to made it far. Come out there. Oh, the fucking tree, bro. Oh, hey, what's up? Pick up. This hook here. It'll break our guy. It's fine, though. Bro, this Steve has a distortion. Oh, no, he doesn't. Wait. Yes, he does. This is Nancy. Played. Double well played. You're just down now. A little bit of lag from her. Nothing that we can't handle though. That's Steve getting the unhook there. Oh, it's DS? What? Crazy. go. And now you're my obsession, though, so I don't even have to worry about Steve. Yeah, we're gonna... No, we're gonna put her over here. I don't think that we're getting our eight hooks this match, but we can try. Hello, Dwight. And I'm one. You say it's better to go for a P100 uh, to prestige uh, the more important killers for their other perks? No, I would say get every perk to level 1. If you can get every perk to level 1, then you can go for any, you know, anything that you would really want. Where the fuck did he go, dude? Good dodge, good dodge. Yeah, he was down there no matter what. Because he ran that way. If he ran forward, he could dodge it. Alright, we might get our seven hooks. Or our eight hooks. We need one more. Okay. 
Billiam over back. Well played. Shack pallet's still up, so free drop. Break. She was so smart there. Free drop will break. Gonna get the unhook on him. Continue chasing here. Go like that. We're gonna miss. We telly. Find Dwight. Dwight does not have a pallet. And he goes, and that is our eight hooks. That's all we needed. I don't think Dwight's dead, though. I think he's the only one who's not. Hey, how's it going, Juno? How you how you doing today? You're going to BPS on Chucky? You had 130 before the event? Nice. I'm probably, like, pretty low on BPS myself on uh, Unknown. Damn. I missed. Ah! Alright, GG's. That is a kill. Thought you were about the P100 Nemesis? No. Nemesis is on my list somewhere, but he's not, like, top of the list. I do enjoy Nemesis, though. He can be fun. Shame. Oh, distortion. <laughs> oh, bro, sad. Here's the big upset. Who the hell ran to that gen then? Oh, neither, neither of them are at the gen. Alright, let's eat the DS. Come on, I know you got it. Let's see it. There it is. There's no shot, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. Bro, I just 12 hooked this game and the last play of the game was me shooting a ball and grabbing someone out of a locker in literally one second. That is absurd. That is absurd. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit, dude. Uh, I didn't make it to the blood zone. That was crazy. Oh my god. These guys are destroying me, too. Dude, this fucking Dwight.
<laughs> Let's go 1v1, dog. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. He's only got 307, bro. Nah, I don't want to do a fucking 1v1. That's not points, bro. <laughs> but what's his name? Banned on DBD main account? Oh, he's gone, dude. He fucking left. What a loser. That guy has loser behavior. Someone's very mad. Aw, baby needs his bottle. Wah. Wah. <laughs> Dude's just mad because he's angry. Yeah, his main account's banned. Why do you think that is? Why do you think that is, chat? Why do you think that is? You got all survivors of P3 this event? Uh, okay. <laughs> His bum ass perks are the last of the bunch. True. Congratulations, though. Sorry, what I miss? Uh, a baby survivor uh, trying to get me to 1v1 him. His main account is banned. His main account's banned. I would 1v1 him just to make him more mad. I don't want to do that, though. Like, it's not worth my time to indulge his, you know... His fucking ego. Oh, one v one me a shack. One v one me a shack. Shut the fuck up, bro. He's banned on his main account. What do you think that means? It means he was a cheating idiot. He's terrible at the game because he's terrible at the game, and he's mad because he's terrible at the game. Like that's all there is to it. We don't need a one v one him to know. Bro's main account was banned, probably because he was hacking. I wouldn't be surprised if this if, if his current account also gets banned, bro. <laughs> For how he talks to people in game. All right, let's go. One distortion user. Uh, we don't care about the guy in here. Come over here. This map, I'm actually kind of scared for their update. I don't know what they're going to do with it. Just in case someone else is on it, you know. Come down here. Yeah, well played. I thought she was going to dodge, like, super far into this way, but she did not. We got the window humpers experience, guys. Look at that. Beautiful, right? Tea bags. No play? Redrop, break. Kind of got her MO. I kind of want to bounce this off the car. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. 
I would want to be 1M uh, because I'm bored and feel like <laughs> creating another Fortnite player. True. Oh, fuck. This was not even close. I see her, though. Is she just hiding in the bush? Oh, my God. Look at this Jill. Look at her, dude. Oh, my God. She's so cute. Oh, my God. She's so cute. That was dramaturgy. Oh my god, she's adorable. Alright, let's go after her. We can probably get two or like a... Yep, very nice. I will leave you slugged on the floor. You want to play this? You can stay on the floor. Actually, you know what? Let's pick her up. I think that she has DS. We'll eat it now. Nope, she doesn't have DS. On the floor, or on the uh, hook she goes. They finish that gen there. We can come over here, and this is going to be a very, very interesting snipe. Oh, there's fucking trees here. Right there. No, I hit the car. Sad. Cool. Just gotta full run this. Very nice. Can run over this way. Kind of leave her. Go back. Didn't hit the ash. That's sad. Oh, she got it. I was going to teleport there. She wasn't fast enough. Cool. Ever since you yelled at me that the Wesker meme add-on was actually good, you've been using it. Wesker meme add-on is really good. Oh my god! The value! I don't have a hook there, so I'm gonna have to hook here. Question is, where did she run? Oh, they ran this way? She dead hearted. Oh my god, that means that she doesn't have shit. Wow, dude. You're correct. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Hello. Dude, she she teabagged me at the start of the game and now she's giving up. Like, come on, you have two gens done already. There's no need. I'm going to drop because uh, I don't have any good hooks. I'm just going to telly. Nice. Yeah, I'll take that. Cool. Bro, you need to gather clips like those. There's uh, plenty. Yeah, for sure. There's going to be one montage in the video. I'm not going to do, like, anything more than that for this one. Outside. <laughs> I 
miss, dude. I hear Ash. Where the fuck is he, dude? I have not a clue. He's got to still be around, right? I don't even know, dude. He found hatch GG's. What is my MMR with Nurse? He had two survivors that could actually loot me, and then um, two consistently downed without using blinks. Yeah, I mean, it, it happens. <laughs> GG's. All right, so yep, uh, we'll do one more match, and then we're gonna have to spend to uh, get a prestige on uh, Billy. How many more challenges do I need? Okay, well I guess I don't get a no. They were supposed to add the feature where you could like select the challenge uh, while waiting in a lobby. Normal DBD matchmaking. Yeah, normal DBD matchmaking. Like, MMR system is not, like, super consistent if you don't play... Or if you, um... Yeah, if you don't play a killer for quite some time. But the second that you start to play them a little bit, your MMR will basically be capped. <laughs> it sucks. Welcome back. He was killing... <laughs> I don't think that I'm going to be able to finish this whole, uh thing guys bp cap is so stupid i mean yeah i guess but like if there wasn't a bp cap i would literally just get 110 mil just level up a character from zero to 100 at some point it wouldn't be anything special though it would just be like exhausting all my resources on all my killers and then just saying ah here we go new killer that has resources I would like the D uh, the blood point cap to be removed straight up though. Howdy. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> okay, he's wiggling now. I can't do any of this. He just wants out. I'm just gonna get him off the hook. You go down. Doink. Uh, 
This guy wants out of the match. We'll take him out of the match. You wait P100, my favorite killer licensed character, and wait three years. Yeah, I get that. I would do that too. Like, I would just always have 100 mil just on my account. Okay. Unknown is so IP, I'm not gonna play seriously now. World first P100 unknown would be the first person who downloads the update the fastest. Not necessarily true. The world first P1 unknown is the person who uh, updates it the fastest. I don't know why they gave up though. That's cringe. I would have liked to actually play a serious match here. Well played. It's more like this. Very nice. Ooh, that didn't hit. Ooh, nice. Good shit on her. Okay, well, we mind gamed her like that. I don't know how that mind game worked. I might genuinely be world first P1 unknown if you count PTB. Uh, on PTB, I was leveling pretty quickly, though, to be fair. Um, it takes me, like, 500 years to download the update. Bro was hiding in a locker, so I guess it doesn't really matter here. Should I just fucking face camp her so she gets anti-tunnel and then I can just, like, three-hook her? <laughs> be that asshole. Should I just, like, sit at the end of the hallway here? at the end of the hallway. Oh, she has fucking Delhi. Delhi OTR. Amazing. This is her OTR. Can't telly. Not quick enough. It's not gonna come back quick enough, I should say. I'm gonna vault this. Okay, never mind. And we're just gonna wait. I'm gonna literally wait out her DS. Oh, she has tenacity unbreakable. Tenacity, Unbreakable, DS. She doesn't have DS anymore. And probably Flip Flop. Maybe Power Struggle. Just raw Power Struggle. Can't tell if it was that gen or this gen. It's definitely this gen. But he has distortion, so he could be anywhere now. He could have ran upstairs. He could have ran downstairs uh, elsewhere. <coughs> and they took away uh, no scope. Deathslinger was there? yeah. Deathslinger was nerfed like way way back um, a few years ago now. They upped his terror radius, nerfed his ability to, um, 
you know, scope in, and that was about that. All right, she's going to die in a second here. And now we wait. Yay! Oh, he's running in the direction where Hatch probably is, so he gets it. GG's. One forty three is all we got. And they just immediately left. Uh she got nurse tech. Nurse tech, nurse tech. <laughs> Alright. In all honesty, I'm probably going to do the last killer challenge um, for the tome. And then that'll be the end of stream. Just a short stream. Because I do kind of just want to chill. I've played way too much DBD recently. Oh, I never knew that was the last killer challenge. Okay. Do I have enough to buy the Oni outfit? Or not the Oni outfit, the LED pants now? I do! I have enough to get both of them! Oh my god, I don't have to play the whole challenge! Wow! Okay, well, I said I'll play one more, so I guess I will. Um, let's see if we can put on a challenge. Steal two droplets or hit survivors uh, while at, under the effects of a blood zone. That one's probably easier. All right, this will be the last match of the stream, guys. I know it was a uh, shorter stream than normal, but, yeah, I've played way too much of this event. <laughs> and I just, I, just, uh, I just hopped on to play some chill games. These were a lot of fun, I'm not going to lie. I had a lot of fun with the matches today. Um... And it was just fun to just chill, you know? I'll probably be back on uh, Tuesday, just kind of playing around. Maybe some Billy. Um, maybe some Unknown. Maybe some Survivor, even, too. That might be fun. But, yeah. Thanks for joining me, guys. It's been fun. Got some kooky, crazy shots today. And some of them are 100% going in the video. Not a question. I already have, like, a full match that I want to put in the video. And, yeah, like I said, the uh, the unknown P100 video is going to have a slightly different format than the uh, the Chucky and the Anniversary video. Um, it's going to have more of a similar format to my Prestige 100 guide, uh, how, like how to spend blood points efficiently and stuff like that. Um... It's going to have only one montage. The montage is going to be at the end. But, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoy that when that comes out. I haven't started working on it yet. I've just been literally taking a break. I've had work the past three days. So, I've been taking a little bit of a break. Just kind of chilling. I didn't hit the pallet in the right angle. Shame. He comes. No, he's going to go upstairs. <laughs> that was such a beast answer what I did there oh shame that's fine come down this way she's not going to expect it we Live? No live. Wow, brave. That's what we like to call brave from this Michaela here. Damn. Right there should be good. Nah, shame. 
I actually think this... Okay, never mind. He just full left it. I think that room with the two god pallets is actually really, really strong for uh, unknown. They finish a gaming room. I'm gonna break this pallet. Shame, dude. Well played there. Damn. Well played. I don't know if I'm gonna finish this challenge straight up. I don't think it matters that much, though. Oh, it doesn't go through that railing. That's sad. Fucking hit down or that thing there? That's so sad. Oh, I'm so bad, dude. Yeah, the game is not one of my maps for sure. Like, uh, what the fuck was that? <laughs> All right, let's get him on a hook. Best feeling is when you randomly uh, guess someone's in a locker. Yeah, it is. It's very good. I can't find anyone, dude. What the hell? Sweet. We finished our challenge, guys. This will get. Do a little spin. Telly down. I have friends tech. How is she dead? What? Man, you don't have range on this map like you do on others. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can shoot through those. Pretty sure you can shoot through the pallet racks. Free drop drops. Oh, shame. I shot way too prematurely. I didn't even pay attention to where I was looking. So where the fuck did she go? Like, uh, I'm not going to kill him. 
She's very good. I will break it. Ah, shame. Too slow. Now this girl's very good. She knows everything to do, dude. Kind of fucked that up. Shit, if I shot the other side, that would have hit her. Well played. I would like to hook this girl, because I haven't touched her once. She definitely seems to know how to play against this guy. But it's not really worth my time to go after her, you know? Pre-drop on the god palette. No pre-drops, but she's going to camp it. Break. Blind. Oh my god, dude. She's too good. Thank god the lingering got her. at the other gate. She's giving me quite the amount of time. Hit her with that. I can get her. If she cuts the corner here, which of course she does. Oh, we can get her. Nope, never mind. Can't get her no more. I can get her if she fucks us up. Yeah, I do get her. Sweet GG's. This TP is way better than Dredge, it really is. Yeah, but it's also kind of random. Kind of. You can you can manipulate it to your advantage. You really can. You just have to tap it. Oh my god, the bounce! You go. GG's. That lady's gonna go look for a hatch, huh? Close the hatch. We close it. Thank you.
Very nice. Very, very nice. Ah, the Michaela had a four. Oh, she just had raw for the people. She didn't even buckle up. That's crazy. Very nice. Will there be a custom? Nah, we're about to end stream here. That was the last match of the stream. We are going to spend our blood points first. Why not? You know? The best feeling? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I read that. Uh, I feel like Unknown is just a shitty combination of Dredge and Artist. Absolutely not. Oh, shit. He's kind of more similar to Clown and Huntress with how his uh, projectile works. And his TP is the smoothest TP in the game. The problem is that it has counterplay, so it's not, like, amazingly good. But it's easily the smoothest and most powerful TP in the game without the counterplay. Not a question. Match reversal and anti-loop in some cases is way better on dredge. I don't know about that one. Like, unknown's anti- You just have to play unknown like a weirdo. If you want to, like, make unknown feel powerful, you have to play really weird. What if unknown got a low, low taper fade? <laughs> then you already kind of have one? Look at that. All right. Let's spend our points, and then uh, we'll be ending stream here. And by spend our points, I mean get one more prestige level. I'm going to keep the 800k just chilling. Because I don't like to have, like, a little bit of a level in a character. Just not how I go. You completely control the TP on Dredge. Yeah, but it's, like... Even in loops, survivors still have counterplay to it because they can just walk into it and, um, like, then you can't teleport. If there's another survivor helping, then it's just done. Like, you kind of just get shit on. And it's not nearly as smooth as, um, Billy, or not Billy, uh, Unknown's teleport. Especially if you have blurred photo, you can just kind of destroy survivors. And Dredge TP is predictable because you can kind of see it. You're getting slowed as well. Um, but Unknown's Teleport, you don't really want to use that much in anti-loop situations. The majority of what you're trying to do with um, Unknown's Teleport is confuse the survivor. Like, that's what I've learned. You want to use it, like, almost immediately after you hit an M2 on a survivor... Just to confuse them on where you are so that you can follow up with another M2. He is a lot about confusion and manipulating uh, variables in your favor. Which can be difficult. A lot of people say uh, Blurred Photo is his best add-on. It is. It really is his best add-on. Like, blur Blurred Photo, first of all, is a common, so that already, you know, puts it at, like, a high thing. If a good add-on is a common, it already makes it one of the top-tier add-ons, because you're going to be getting a shit ton of them. Like, if I look at my unknown now, and I look at his eerie add-ons, I have 122 and 118 of these two. Right? I have a lot of those, and I've got, like, 186, like, you know, a few of these guys... Uh, more. Then I have like 600 of the, of each of the greens, and I have 1,200 and 1,300 of the yellows. And then I come to the commons, I'm at 3,700 or 3,200. Like that's crazy. Not even eerie tape or purple cartridge. The problem is, is like those are iridescents. Like these guys here are iridescents. They're harder to come by, and they cost more blood points. So already, even if they're disgustingly broken, like. They're not as good as a common item being of, like, the same quality. Like, Blurred Photo could easily, easily be an iridescent add-on. And it's not because, uh, reasons. It's, in my opinion, his best add-on. Like, no questions asked. This one's, uh, wait a minute, is it this one? No, this one. This one's also ab among his best add-ons because it's just, it's just no downsides to teleporting. And then this one's pretty good, too. This one's really good, like... I don't know, dude. He has a lot of good add-ons, but, like, Blurred Photos is his best one. 
Because you're always going to be teleporting. Like, you're never not teleporting with unknown. Unless survivors are just on top of it, you know? That would be terrible for an Eerie? No, I think that would be disgusting for an Eerie. I think it's already disgusting, and it's more disgusting than his Eerie add-ons. Giving this killer 50% reduced um, shit to just come out of a teleport is disgusting. It's absolutely absurd. A good Eerie add-on. He has uh, two pretty decent Eerie add-ons. It would be a terrible Eerie, but that's something behavior would do. I don't think so. People are... You're just saying that it's a terrible Eerie because it's currently a common item. Like, if they made it an Eerie, yeah, that would be bad. It would be annoying because it is very powerful and it's a common item. And it's like, oh, shit, well, they just upped the rarity of it. Now it's going to be harder to come by. But, like... 50% is a lot. That is basically, if you teleport and a survivor is even remotely near you, you're gonna hit them with an M1. Like, they will t take damage. It's an it's a, it's effectively enduring as an add-on, but for teleporting. And you guys know me. I put a lot of value on enduring. Like, I can tell you right now, enduring's on this guy. Enduring's... I have, I have enduring on Wraith. Um, I run... I don't run Enduring on Nurse, obviously, but we come around here. You can see I run Enduring on a lot of different killers as I comb through them and not a single fucking one of them has Enduring. <laughs> all right. You know what? Bad example, but, like, all my P100s or most of them use Enduring. So, like, we'll come around here. Um, Enduring on Blight. Enduring on Nemi. Enduring on Nemi is disgusting. Um... Enduring on Wesker, Enduring on Knight. And then I stopped running Enduring because I started running Friends builds and they're disgusting. But yeah, I run Enduring on a lot of killers. It's a very strong perk in general. And I think his TP being, you know, 50% regain control, that's disgusting. It's super good. It makes it easier to swing faster? Yeah, it does. I don't get why the tape removes a hallucination. Because eerie add-ons have to have a downside, apparently. <coughs> Pyramid has the best eerie add-ons in the game. True, dude. I've never seen eerie add-ons as good as Pyramid Head's current eeries are. Singularity has the strongest status effect, plus another upside as an eerie. Unknown's tape sucks in comparison. Yeah, Unknown's tape isn't, like, super good, but the other one is good. What is it? Like, this one's okay. This one's just fine. This one is really good. This one doesn't have any downsides. It decreases your cooldown of your teleport. Leaves decoys behind that, um... Uh, that take 10 seconds longer to disappear. And they have a terror radius on top of them. And a red stain. Which means that you should... Uh, I believe... I don't know. I've actually never used it. But I think it makes you undetectable. Because it leaves, um... Oh, no, it has the same red stain and terror radius as the unknown. So it just makes it confusing for survivors. It helps with that confusing aspect. And if you run it with blurred photo, you're just going to be chilling. You really are. Enduring isn't good on Nemesis. You shouldn't walk into pallets, uh, but wait in front of them with uh, the tentacle and hit them while they're dropping the pallet. Even with Enduring, you can still get a hit after a stun a lot of the time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I think Enduring allows you to just get that hit much easier, you know? If you have Enduring and you get hit with a pallet and you already swung through the pallet with your whip and hit them, you now just insta-down them. Well, you know, you infect them into a hit. I've done it plenty of times. This is a very strong perk on Nemesis. I think Enduring is uh, much more powerful than you might think. And I recommend you give it a try. If you haven't done it in a little while. Area OSS makes it harder for survivors to keep track of you. Wait, what? I'm confused. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, um... His other add-on. I barely look at add-ons, dude. Straight up. Yeah, this one. This one makes it more difficult for survivors to keep track of you because you're going to be having two terror radiuses.
Oh, I'm so dumb for that. I could have done that way better. It's fine. But yeah, I put a lot of I put a lot of value on Enduring's name because it's such a powerful perk. It just allows you to get free hits in places that you otherwise wouldn't. I think the perk slot is more worth uh, it than a difficult rare hit. I don't think it's rare at all. I get a lot of hits like that. If you just run through pallets and don't care about them, um, you just get a lot of free hits. I don't know if you guys know who Yerv is, but I was playing Blight against him at one point, and I hit him with an Enduring 2-tap because... He just wasn't expecting it. And then the game glitched out. <laughs> the fucking main pallet of uh, Borgo. I broke it, but it wasn't broken. So you couldn't just, you couldn't go through, what is it, uh, main building anymore. Tenor has a 0.3 second wind up. When a pallet is near a corner, uh, you don't get value. If you wind up your power and launch it and someone drops the pallet on you, you can wind it up again and hit the pallet or hit them. And now you're just on top of them even faster than you were before. I put a lot of value in chase, though, to be fair. Like, I don't really put a lot of value into, like, gen regression or, you know, perks that allow you to swap targets quickly. I just put a lot of value into pure raw aggression. <laughs> like, this build is pure raw aggression, even though, like, you know, it doesn't look like it. This is just, I'm going to keep downing survivors and there's nothing you can do about it. People uh, really do expect you to respect pallets. I mean, good survivors will expect you to just run through them, but they will also attempt to make you respect the pallet. And, I mean, good survivors will also play around that a lot. I don't know. I still find it very, very good to run Enduring. Thoughts on Chucky's add-ons? Bro, I don't even know Chucky's add-ons. <laughs> uh, his Eeries are dog shit. Um, that is terrible. That's not bad. That's awful that one's terrible now because um mangled is not good portal t portable tv is fun but it doesn't really have a use case if you if you're waiting till end game you probably lost the game already um rat poison's honestly disgusting running shoes was good it's not good anymore that is terrible silk pillow is absolute garbage um, Scamper reveals auras within 12 meters of you for five seconds. Wait a minute. That one's kind of good, too. Rat Poison, Yardstick. Rat Poison's way better, but Yardstick's not bad. Missing a Slice and Dice. That's a good add-on. That's a good add-on. Um, that's a good add-on. That one's a good add-on, too. That's a really good add-on. <laughs> Um, this is dog shit. That's not bad. Decrease slice and dice, uh, hit cooldown by 7%. That's not bad at all. Uh, especially considering you can stack it with, uh, is it this one? You can stack them and get, a 21% extra cool or 22%. Very nice. That one's bad. And that one's bad. <laughs> all right. Oh, there you go. I'm not a big fan of Enduring on Nemi. It has a uh, very big room for mistake. I don't know. I, I disagree. I find Enduring to just be a good perk and a solid perk on a lot of people. But that's just because I do find a lot of value with uh, Enduring on... Even on Nemesis. Like, just on a lot of killers, I find value with it. Scale of 1 to 10. His add-ons are good. I'd give them, like, a 6. But yeah, that's going to be the end of stream for today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, if you guys are going to be playing any matches yourselves, I hope you guys have a wonderful time playing. And if you guys are going to be starting out your days or going to bed soon, I hope you have good days and good nights. For now, that's all the time that I have. I will be back on Tuesday 
Uh, probably start at 1 p.m. EST, and uh, we'll probably get some more matches of Unknown in. Maybe play a little bit of, um, you know, honestly, I kind of want to play some Nurse. I definitely want to play some Blight because Blight is going to be getting his hug tech removed. So we should probably play a few games of that just to, you know, honor his memory. But yeah, other than that, uh, I will see you guys on Tuesday. Thanks for stopping in. Thank you for hanging out with me. It's always been a pleasure, guys. I'll see you guys on Tuesday. Have a good one.